See some construction on I-17 near Camp Verde as you head down to the valley in the coming weeks. Yeah, but what you can't see down below is the team of scientists working for months alongside construction crews under the bridge to protect a fragile ecosystem. Team Charles Rachel Cole shows us the efforts to preserve all the creatures that call the Verde River home. Making their way through the mud, researchers from Northern Arizona University are combing the Verde Riverbed looking for any signs of life they can find. Here we have a little tiny fish, a little larva, hard to say whether it's a native or a non-native. We're trying to protect all of our fish. Professor Erica Novak and her team are working to preserve native and some non-native species of fish, insects, reptiles, whatever they find in this part of the Verde River. The I-17 bridge that passes over near Camp Verde needed some work to reinforce the bridge piers, which have been starting to deteriorate. The Arizona Department of Transportation needed to divert the flow of the river to this man-made channel to complete the project. It's a bit of a fish salvage, and we're catching everything uh, in terms of inverts, um, fish. We also have uh, you know, toads, and lizards, anything we can catch. We're moving away from the construction site uh, in, in order to get them somewhere safely. Painstaking detail has been paid to save as much wildlife as possible in the riverbed. It gives these grad students from NAU some real-world experience protecting the fragile ecosystem of the Verde River. The Verde River is you know, a very important ecosystem. We just want to minimize impact, and that includes saving all of the living uh, species that are here. Once the bridge work is completed, water will be diverted to another part of the riverbed and Dr. Novak and her team will move too, helping to keep the diverse ecosystem of the Verde River alive and well for future generations. It's, you never know what you're going to find in the Verde River. And that was Rachel Cole reporting such important work there, Lindsay.